Hey guys, Empress Lux Ashe. Please like, subscribe. Um, so I'm still on takeoff. I'm still. I don't. Yeah. No arrests have been made. I don't like that. So, but I realized out of all the readings I've done, I haven't done a reading on Migos fans, which was the supposed to be a security guard that day. Just gonna keep that my comments to myself um so i kind of want to know what has this energy been like since takeoffs passing and another thing i ain't been liking i know you can't tell people how to handle grief but quavo mm, i don't know my man if my family got hurt or killed all that street stuff go out the window that's your family you know what i'm saying but um also get he um maybe afraid of his life afraid afraid of his life why would i say that afraid for his life uh but another video for another day what is mingo band's energy like since takeoff's passing Ooh. i take that because i don't want to be on here long <laughs> y'all can't never say well I guess you know let me shut up so you have the will of fortune card feels like this was bad luck he had no control and he's going through like a negative phase because I think they was saying that that's Quavo's older brother I'm not too sure can y'all not see my card well I should, the will of fortune is the first card that came out He he's feeling really shitty the sun card if this was upright this is the happiest card in the deck but it's not which means just looking at this he's not happy he's yeah he's feeling down sad depressed negative like but it's almost an energy of yes takeoff has but he's looking at it on almost taking it looking at it from an arrogant stance like i mean you were supposed to be security so i know a lot of people i know i'm looking at you funny but i'm not even in that circle so you can you imagine so that's what i mean he's like sympathizing almost more so with himself than the situation which he is but he's like can you imagine i don't even think he went to the funeral i didn't see him at the funeral then the lovers, Gemini energy, take off was the Gemini. Um, yeah, see, this is the energy, it's reversed. This is the energy of, of imbalance and disharmony. So I don't think he came to the funeral. So if we're looking at it like, damn, bro, you had one job to do. You didn't do it. Can you imagine what's being said behind the scenes? Um, and this is the energy of uh, just conflicting bad choices blaming himself he's suffering in this disharmony and imbalance somewhere and it's almost like he needs to practice self-love and not try to hurt himself because of the situation or like not turn to alcohol drugs you know guilt will eat you up you know sagittarius energy ten of wands yeah this is saying it um pretty much the same thing it's two tens that came out um he's carrying a burden like i feel like even though quavo looks funny funny to me more people as just on a media aspect and from the us as the viewers more people are blaming him and i find it's funny that this is sagittarius energy and uh also the sagittarius so that you you know he might be it placing more to blame on Migos bands for that that has Sagittarius energy right there. Um, he and Migos bands is just really feeling burnt out, and I feel like a lot of people are blaming him, like people in the, um, in the circle. Then you have Seven of Cups, Scorpio energy. We're still in Scorpio season. He's still confused on what happened, and this is. See, conflicting bad choices with the lovers, and now this is overwhelmed by his choices. He's blaming himself. 
very confused. He feels like everything, he, like, you know how you retrace your steps when you lose something or when something happens? You're just like, what did I go wrong? That's where he's at right now. He realizes, I think he's seen now that that whole day was a setup. And he's just like, why didn't I see it that day? Um, it's also the energy of, you see how they was arguing with Quavo? Now he's seen as that was a diversion. I was I wasn't too sure if he had anything to do with it, but um, with those cards, with these cards, I'm not getting that. He looks like he's from the last reading. He's he's hurting more than Quavo is, and I noticed that from the funeral. Even though I could stand up here crying, and it, I don't be real, you know, people are good at acting, but just based off the energy, Quavo's energy, and all this energy from the funeral. Something wasn't right about Quavo's energy. Unless he's one of those people that just handles their emotions well. I don't like that. I really don't like that. And I saw a lot of other people making those comments too. Um, so what is next for Migos dance in reference to Takeoff's passing? And he hasn't said anything. So at least in the media, like he's, you know, did his rest in peace and he put his poem that he had made for Takeoff. Um, also something that stood out to me was where the part he goes, ask God what I have to do to be with you again. I, I, yeah, I didn't really care for that. So I asked what's next for me goes fans. Uh oh. Cancer energy. It resonates with what I just said. Two of cups in reverse. This, what's no, it's just the same energy. I thought this was the same card. He's heavy in his emotions. A lot of disharmony. I, broken communication. People are not fucking with him. That was fucking with him. I, like I said, people are still going to be blaming him. There's tension. Uh, people are not trusting him. Or it could be the energy of who do I trust. Like he's not trusting people too. Because you got to realize these guys was around people they thought they could trust. Now it's like, where did I go wrong? Aquarius energy, five of swords. <laughs> is this just more energy of getting away with something, conflict, disagreements, feeling defeated, and the energy of winning at all costs? Three of ones, Aries energy. Quavos or Aries? Yeah, he's going to have obstacles to some goals he may have had prior to this. And it's just the energy he's playing is small, like kind of standing in the shadows. Mm. I actually feel bad for him. And then people were saying his bullets is, is killed takeoff. So everybody's not knowing. You. All the people there, no one seems to know what happened. So that's kind of did my bullet kill? That's crazy. And I like, was he even brought in to be questioned? Not to say if it wasn't him, I don't want him to be that to happen. But was he even questioned? It's like, it's somebody need to get arrested. And I don't like that. Like, are y'all really going to stick to that narrative? It was an accident when everyone and their mother knows it was not an accident. Uh, what's going on with Quavo? <coughs> Excuse me. What's going on with Quavo right now? I should say, what's going on with Quavo and Migo Band's relationship? What's going on with Qu Quavo and Migo Band's relationship? I'm not 100% on the relationship between them, but someone said he's the older brother. So, how has their relationship been since takeoff passing? And I, I, I never, uh-oh. Why is the same card is passing out? So that wasn't a general message. That was coinciding with him and Quavo. Thank you. Uh-oh. I asked how their relationship is. You have three of Pentacles, Capricorn Energy, 
they're not dealing with each other. Obviously, it's a conflict. We know where the conflict arises from, and it's disharmony. I feel like Quavo's blaming him. Or is it just to have blame on someone? Seven of Swords again. Mm-mm. Betrayal. Feeling like you got away with something and acting strategically. Uh, ooh. Did this come out? No, I don't think it came out enough. And then King of Swords. Someone's making a Gemini and Taurus energy. Someone's making head over heart decisions with this situation. Ace of Pentacles. So they could ultimately have abundance, new career, financial opportunity, new ventures, prosperity. Then you got the King of Pentacles. This keeps coming out. Leo, Vir Leo Virgo energy. Greed. Just obsessed with wealth and status. How people view you. Maybe looking at this as a material loss. And the lovers again. Gemini energy. Yeah, imbalance. These two are not on good terms right now. I feel like... Especially this Seven of Swords. I feel like that's Quavo's energy. Seven of Swords. Is this Quavo's energy? Is this Quavo's energy? Is this Seven of Swords? Quavo's energy. No. Let me get this other card. This was the card that fell all down. It's the two of cups. And this no. So if it's not Quavo's, I asked how things between Quavo and Nigo Bands. So is um the seven of swords Nigo Benz energy? No. And it came out again. So um clarify the seven of swords energy. Clarify the seven of swords energy. Yes. I guess it's referring to that night they were just surrounded by people they thought they could trust and obviously not. King, Knight of Pentacles, the fool, and, you know, someone's feeling stuck since this incident and is holding back because <coughs> of the bad choices. It could be both of the energies. Gemini energy here with the Nine of Swords. They have a lot of different emo emotions since takeoff's passing. Then this is came out again. Betrayal. Three of Wands. Um, Quavo may definitely be just trying to prepare for what's next. Kind of think of a game plan. I know one thing. Aries are very like passionate. Like, so if this is really hurting him. It's really bringing him through the ringers. Um, that betrayal energy may be like this. Not broke the communication is broken between the two, but both of them may be realizing how badly they was betrayed by the people they were around today. And I want to do a separate reading on Migos. Um, so I'm just gonna ask that betrayal is stems from. Mop, what did I say, Migos? Mop ties. Yep. Yeah. Look at that. The death card. The betrayal stem from that night that caused death. Then you have 
takes the source of Aquarius energy again. Something it's a lot of Aquarius energy come is coming out. So something may happen in Aquarius season pertaining to this. It's the energy of unfinished business and emotional baggage. Um, do make most of my do Nego Vans feel like Migos portrayed them? Does he feel like they portrayed him or them that night? Maybe. Maybe. Two maybe. So they're not 100%. Well, Migo Benz isn't 100% sure. Um, Does Quavo feel like the Migos? Does Quavo feel... <laughs> why am I keep saying the Migos? Does Quavo feel like Mob Ties betrayed him that night? Yes. Why does Clavel feel like that? Why does he feel like that? Because they were supposed to be respecting differences with the five of ones. They agreed to disagree about something. They're supposed to be avoiding conflict. Aquarius energy again. The star, this is fame. The star, like, he's a star. They were supposed to be avoiding something because of his status or their status. But they didn't. Then you got the devil, obviously, in reverse. We see what happened at night. I ask you, why does he feel like they betrayed him? Um, his energy of detaching from this, and maybe he feels like they are, are trying to restore control. Aquarius energy again, something definitely is going to happen in Aquarius season. Someone has this in their chart. I don't really know much about mob ties. There was definitely a disagreement, like almost a competition as well. Oh, no, we saw that. But then you have the Justice card. Quavo wants justice. Or wants some sort of truth and clarity. Uh, I did not want to make a long reading. <laughs> Why hasn't Nigo, why hasn't Quavo, like, said any names avoiding conflict? Mm. Um, does Quavo fear for his life? Does Quavo feel for his life, possibly? Yes. This card is about public recognition and self-confidence, victory and progress. He feels, he fears for his life and his status. Nine of Pentacles. See, I don't like this, you know. He He's obsessed with this false success, but your cousin, not your cousin, your nephew got killed. So it's almost saying I'm not saying anything because of who I am. You feel like, like I'm too screen. My image is screen. Does Quavo know who did this? Wow, that was quick. <laughs> no, but um, 18. There's still secrets in his energy. He doesn't know who physically did that. And um, keep in mind, takeoff birthday is June 18th. Then you got the high priestess. Maybe. Like he, if he listens to his intuition, he knows. If he trusts himself more, he knows. Um, and then you have Six of Pentacles. I, this keeps coming out like something about unpaid debt and power and something about a battle of power and domination. Domination. 
Unpaid Depths came out in Cardi's and Offset reading as well. That's why I keep feeling like, yeah, they wasn't there, but everything leads up to this. Everyone played a part of it. I feel like I do. I keep saying it was a sacrifice, a sacrificial hit. Um, somebody put a bag on both heads or on his head. They couldn't. Maybe they couldn't get Quavo, and I, I set up for takeoff. Like I don't do this. I'm anywhere there. I don't get sad. <laughs> um, bye.